Alright everybody, we're back here with Pokemon Red. And we're going to, uh, continue where we left off here. Uh, we just had gotten a bicycle. So now we're off to... Old, what's it call it? The Cycling Road. And we'll pretty much just, uh... Wipe out everybody out there. Because we will need all the experience we can get for the, uh... Elite Four and whatnot. Just go with headbutt here. No need to be too overzealous. Especially on a Grimer. Special is not too good on Snorlax, is it? Cue ball. And again, we don't quite need to get too crazy here. Or maybe we do. That kind of hurt, didn't it? Let's go ahead and go for the double edge. Try to rest here. Focus energy does nothing in this game, so that's awesome. Uh, we'll just go with headbutt. Chop, why not? That low kick really hurt. I don't care. We'll definitely need a du uh, double edge for wheezing. Oh man! Uh, should I go for the rest?
So that rest is probably the right move. Oh, man. Oh, well. We'll go ahead and hurry up and switch out here. Uh, this part of the game, with the cycling road and the uh, fishing pier on the other side of Saffron City and uh, Sylph Co. It's going to be a really grindy part of the game. And uh, so what we're going to do here is we're going to try to not fart around as much as possible and just hurry up and get through it. So it's as least tedious as possible. When I first got to this part of the game when I was a kid uh, we uh, around the same time we started having a, a field day at school where we had to go out and do like obstacle courses and we had different lengths of runs that we had to do and there was you know basically all kind of it's kind of like the Olympics but you know in school form you know, just to get the kids to be physically active and whatever. And, um... You know, you got fur... You know, you got ribbons and stuff. You know, if you were... You know, they had, like, first place, second place, third place, you know, ribbons that you could be awarded, you know, if you got in that place among your whole class. And, um... Around that same time... I'd gotten to this area of the game where you had to do the cycling road and everything, and I thought it was, you know, really cool because, you know, like, you know, biking is sort of like a physical activity, and, it, and it's kind of, I don't know, I guess I drew a weird connection with that. That here my character on the game is going up up and down the sloped road on a bicycle. Like if you try to go up here, he goes real slow. So I thought that was pretty cool. Machoke. Oh man, poor Machoke. Oh, poor Machoke. Get wrecked, son. Dang. That should almost be considered Pokemon abuse. Yeah, especially when the kid beats you to a pulp. It's weird thinking back on it now that when I first played this game, 
I kind of felt like all the NPCs and everything were like adults and stuff that were way older than me. But now it's like, you know, I'm probably older than the majority of, of the people in this game now. Like this cue ball guy. That was, a, that was a good move by Voltorb. Now, I don't know if in Gen 1 light screen stays up after the Pokemon faints or not. Oh, and now we're on the Freaking Charmeleon. Who has just the hardest time getting through these battles, it seems like. You know, don't get me wrong, Charme Charmeleon's not a bad Pokemon, it's just like compared to like freaking Hypno and Snorlax and crap. You know, it just seems like it's more of an uphill battle with him. Trying to get through some of these trainers. You gotta trade him, that's why he won't evolve. Yeah, Charmeleon's just not doing very good. So here's what we're gonna do with Charmeleon here. We're gonna take the- oh man, I stored the freaking rare candies. But yeah, we're gonna forget about using Charmeleon for a little while and we're gonna use our stockpile of rare candies to uh, level up Charmeleon. Cause he's just having such a hard time. And hopefully, um, the additional time we're only raising four Pokemon will help us to level up a little bit faster and uh, catch up level-wise with some of these trainers out here and make it, you know, just a little bit easier for Charmeleon to go ahead and evolve into Charizard and hurry up and get that flamethrower that he needs so bad. Because that's half of Charmeleon's problem, is he doesn't freaking have... Oh, do I keep Pound or Poison Gas? Let's try Poison Gas. Just for the heck of it. Just to give Hypno a little bit of versatility if we need it. 
Go ahead and make him even more overpowered than he already is. Got to switch out Hypno. But yeah, half of Charmeleon's problem is that he doesn't really have any good moves. His best move is Ember. And then it's almost like freaking Cut is about the same power. Oh, I should have used rest. Crap. What am I doing? Oh, that was lucky. I, d I don't know. Man, that was just so lucky. By all accounts, I should have lost Snorlax there. not lost him having fainted this isn't a nuzlocke I've never actually tried a nuzlocke I should I should one day if I ever do try one I'll try it on the channel And I'll go ahead and use another rest here. Double edge. Hopefully there'll be a trainer up this way that I can use rest on. Oh man, and all I got is freaking double edge. Let's go ahead and use rest here. And double edge. Oh, what the? I 
gonna be painful trying to take down Muck with Vaporeon, being as Muck is so defensive. Let's just get it over with here. And I know this video is running a little bit long, uh, but since we're in a much grindier part of the game here, we're gonna try to knock this part of the part of the map out. And get it over with. Yeah, I got a quick attack. That might be the last guy here. Yeah, see, see how defensive heavy Muck is. Nope, one more guy. And Weezing's about the same as one. Actually, no, not really, is he? Since we're almost done with this, I'm not going to worry about PP. Alright, so that's everything clear. Uh, I do apologize for that being a longer video, but like I said, we're just trying to get this part of the game over with. Uh, hope you did enjoy the video, though. If you did, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.